some people are very good at their job, so much so that it's simply a joy to watch them do what they do. And in this video, we're going to show you some of the very, very best. The truly captivating. These are incredibly efficient workers you'll be mesmerized by. Number 15. Amazing Speed. The faster you work, the more you can get done in a shorter space of time. But some people just take that to the next level. Take this guy cutting onions, for example. We all know how painful it can be to cut onions. You end up crying your eyes out even before you finish cutting the first one. This chef manages to solve that problem by cutting four at once. He pierces a skewer through the top, then slices downwards on each side until he's just left with the skewer. You can't even see any tears flowing from his face. Another chef does the same thing with mushrooms. He takes a skewer, stabs each mushroom through the center, then cuts them all at once to save time and effort. It's far quicker than cutting them individually, that's for sure. Speed in the kitchen is one thing, but what about speed in the dining area? One restaurant combated that problem by having their wait staff move around on roller skates. You might think that would be a recipe for disaster, but they move with such precision and elegance that it's like you're watching a show while you eat. Like this video, smash the subscribe button and click the notification bell right now, or this centipede will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. Now, it's time for the odd topic. We're sure you'll agree, this footage is deeply satisfying. Sure is good to watch people who are good at what they do, do what they do. The technique on display, the manner in which they slot the bricks into place, is almost meditative to watch. Arguably, it's even hypnotic. Watching this is more cathartic than listening to the gentle, swaying waves of the ocean. These guys are seriously good at what they do. Comment down below with the hashtag odd topic and let us know your opinion in relation to what we just showed on screen. With that said, let's keep things moving. Number 14. Dangerous but skilled woodcutting. Not every country has the best technology to make mass-produced furniture and other goods. They often have to rely on old machinery and their hands to produce goods. They don't always even have the best health and safety practices in place. But even though these woodcutters look like they're doing something incredibly dangerous, they are very good at it. And given that he's wearing no shirt and not sporting any scars, it doesn't even look like he's had any problems before. There are two men operating the giant saw, and they slice logs through it into thin pieces. As the saw moves closer to his thumbs, you wonder whether he's not going to move them in time. But he seems to have full control. The piece gets thinner and thinner, and there's less room for error with each cut. Still, he doesn't seem phased by the genuine risk that he's going to lose a finger or hand. In the background, you can see piles of logs, both large and small, so it's definitely not their first rodeo. They clearly have their woodcutting skills mastered. Number 13. Pizza Box Folding Record They call it fast food for a reason. It has to be fast. No one wants to wait a long time when they've just popped in for a quick bite to eat. One former worker at Gabriel Pizza in the West End of Ottawa clearly understood that when she shows off just how fast she can put together a pizza box. Brianna Gray from Ontario worked at the pizza store while she was in high school and shot to internet fame when her brother posted the footage of her pizza box skills to YouTube. I got it. This is my sister at her work. It ended up amassing over a million views. Without even looking at the box, she perfectly folds it, then adds it to piles she's already managed to build. This skill would have surely meant that customers could get their orders a lot faster. Who knows what else she could do quickly in the kitchen? This girl has serious talent. Brianna went on to become an Algonquin College marketing student and no longer works at Gabriel's Pizza. However, her mad skills with pizza won't be forgotten in a hurry. Number 12. High-speed watermelon cutting. There's always a concern that machines will end up replacing man. But what if man is faster than machine? 
These guys cutting watermelons do so with such speed and precision that there's just no way companies would ever replace them with machines. There seems to be a technique that works well with speed. They cut each end off the melon, sit it up on one of the flat ends, then slice down the sides to remove the skin. The first few cuts are slow, but they then speed up until, within seconds, there's nothing but delicious and juicy watermelon flesh. Given how many they probably have to cut, having this speed is essential. Otherwise, they'll probably never get them all done before their shift is over. But you can't just immediately become that good at cutting watermelons. Such efficiency and speed take time. I'm sure they would have cut their fingers many times before getting this good. Although, the second guy is wearing special gloves to stop the blade from cutting him. He may not have as much confidence as he appears to display. Number 11. Speed Twisting Balloon Animals When you're entertaining children at a public event with balloon animals, you have to work quite quickly. Children can be impatient, and they all want a balloon animal or balloon toy. It might be something simple like a sword, or something as complex as a dog or a monkey holding onto a tree with some bananas. However, with time and practice, you just get faster and faster, and that might just land you a Guinness World Record if you're good enough. That actually happened on Britain's Got Talent in 2017. I can confirm that the balloons are correct. It was a valid attempt. Ryan Tracy carried out his BGT audition a little differently from other contestants. He appeared in front of Guinness World Record officials and Britain's Got Talent judges to see if he could claim the record for the fastest time to model five balloon structures blindfolded. The record at the time was 1 minute and 3.6 seconds. It wasn't looking like it would be in his favor at first. His first creation took nearly 30 seconds seconds, but Ryan picked up the pace and created a dog, sword, flower, snail, and caterpillar in 1 minute and 1.3 seconds. He not only got the world record, but a yes from all four judges. Number 10. Fastest Pizza Workers Working in the fast food industry requires you to be fast, and you definitely couldn't accuse Rene Deguia from Sarasota of being slow. In 2015, the 40-year-old was honing his skills so that he could take part in the world's fastest pizza maker competition, a prestigious industry event that Domino set up around three decades prior. The event was held in Las Vegas, and Rene would try his luck at taking home the $3,000 first prize. Practice makes perfect, and Rene sure got in a lot of practice. His video hit the internet courtesy of the Sarasota Herald Tribune, which showed him preparing three pizzas in just 39 seconds. He coats the dough, flattens and spins it, adds sauce, cheese, and pepperoni before moving on to the second and third pizzas. As of 2015, Rene had been with Domino's for 23 years and eventually owned his own store. He won the pizza competition in 2000 and 2005, which goes to show just how good he really is. It probably also helps that he's a competitive table tennis player and that he tries to stay in shape. Rene said he's not as young as he used to be, but you wouldn't know by looking at his fast pizza making skills. Number 9 fastest shirt ironer. Have you ever sped through a chore you didn't want to do because you just wanted it to be over quicker? At first glance, that's what it looks like this shirt ironer is doing. But when you see the pile of shirts he has to iron, and probably by a deadline, he most likely has to be that fast. He picks up a shirt, irons an arm, turns it over, then irons the other arm. With lightning speed, he then flips it onto its front and back to iron each side before inserting a piece of card on the inside and outside to achieve the perfect fold. 
According to Indracina Reddy, who uploaded the video in February 2016, the man manages to iron 200 shirts in one hour. Even though we can't verify that by watching him, his speed shows it's probably quite possible. To be honest, I spend that much time just trying to set up the ironing board and think of reasons not to iron. I couldn't imagine ironing 200 shirts or doing it for a living. We hope he at least makes his customers happy for his Iron Man efforts. Number 8. Super Fast Burger Making Every food service worker has a process for making sure they get the food out quickly. In fact, McDonald's set up their restaurants in the exact same way across all their stores to make sure they can follow the most effective procedures possible. But even if you're working in a street stall rather than a restaurant, you can still get the food out fast by having your own unique set of processes. These burger makers are proof of that. Instead of focusing on one burger at a time, they build several. They generally start by cooking the egg first, as it can sometimes take the longest to prepare. Unless the burgers have meat, of course. While they are cooking, they move on to preparing the buns, which are heated on the pan before sauce and salads are added to them. In mere minutes, these talented cooks can prepare dozens of burgers for hungry customers. No one has to wait too long to satiate their hunger. Perhaps the most surprising thing about these processes is that they only have one or two people in each scenario preparing the burger. You don't always need a massive number of staff to get the job done. Number 7. Fastest Pottery Makers Everyone has their go-to hobby for when they want to relax. For some people, it's knitting or crochet. For others, it's baking, reading, or gardening. Pottery, though, appears near the top of the list. You can feel your hands in the clay, form beautiful shapes, and go at your own pace. Surprisingly, though, it can also be a fast-paced activity. A pottery maker at the Pottery Store in Pigeon Forge, Tennessee makes it look easy as he forms a dish in under five minutes. While he's doing it, he's chatting away to customers without even becoming distracted or making mistakes. No, not as much anymore, but it, it still happens on Facebook. But if you think he's fast, then what about this guy who's record-breaking fast? Joel Cherico set out to break the world record for the most pots thrown in one hour by an individual. Joel set out to break the world record of 150. And instead of breaking pottery, he broke that world record after all. In 2016, Joe threw 159 pots and set the new pottery world record. They then set about preparing their record evidence to submit it to the Guinness World Record. Number 6. Fastest Sushi Chef in Japan Sushi is one of those foods that many of us love to eat, but very few of us know how to prepare properly. You might master the sushi roll one day, then completely butcher it the next. But there are some people who have mastered their craft, and it really shows. They've even made a name for themselves in Japan and around the world for their speed, precision, and quality when it comes to producing sushi. In Japan, one sushi chef shows just how fast he is when working in a conveyor belt sushi restaurant in Shinjuku, Tokyo, Japan. As the restaurant fills and the orders pile up, he quickly whips up delicious sushi and piles it onto the conveyor belt as it moves throughout the restaurant. Jeremy Hoff from Omaha also shows off his fantastic sushi skills. He ended up being the fastest sushi chef roller in the world and won a cash prize for his efforts. In the video, you can see someone timing him as he quickly prepares a variety of sushi that all look high quality and accurate. I don't know about you, but I'm hungry for sushi now. Number 5. World's Fastest Typist in today's modern world, it doesn't take much to be one of the fastest typists in the world. We all grew up with keyboards, and most tots have mastered the tablet by the time they go to school. But when computers and typewriters were new, you definitely stood out if you could type at speed. Like Barbara Blackburn, for example. Barbara appeared on The Letterman Show in 1985 as the world's fastest typist. While she wasn't impressed with how her typing speed was turned into comedy, she has proven herself to be quite the master of her craft. 
50 words a minute. Still, it did get me in the Guinness Book of Records. So much so that she appeared in ads for Apple and gained her own Guinness World Record. Her top speed was recorded at 212 words per minute. Barbara puts her speed down to the type of keyboard she uses. While most of us are used to the QWERTY keyboard, Barbara said that particular style was her undoing. She received an inferior grade for typing in high school, and it was this grade that stopped her from graduating at the top of her class. So instead, she uses the Dvorak keyboard, which has vowels on one side and consonants on the other. All of a sudden, she became the fastest typist in the world. Number 4. Fastest Dishwashers the food industry is fast-paced. If you don't work quickly, you get left behind. And by left behind, we pretty much mean fired. Fortunately, these people were able to adjust to the fast pace and ended up being well-known for it. This lady manages to sort through cutlery at lightning speed to make sure she can reset tables for new customers. But this guy isn't messing around either. In a small kitchen, he manages to rinse, sort, and stack a variety of dishes without ever causing any of them to fall down and break. But let's take a moment to appreciate the precision and speed at which this guy rinses and stacks hundreds of plates in just minutes. Yeah, they are all great at their jobs, but the human dishwasher who can clean 50 plates in 10 seconds without smashing any of them is at god level of this game. The plates almost look like a blur in the footage as they move from the dishwasher's hands to the water and out again. To be honest, they must be made of pretty robust materials not to smash. Number 3. Super Fast Packer In 2017, express delivery firms across China delivered 40 billion packages around the world. That's over 100 million packages every day. So you can at least feel a little bit better about seeing the delivery driver every day. You're not the only one spending up a storm. But have you ever thought about the people responsible for packing and taping up those 40 billion packages? You'd imagine they've got some pretty impressive arm muscles. I mean, just check out how fast they tape up a box to make sure it's gonna be safe and secure on the way to its destination. While they add tape reasonably slowly to the top, they then spin the box around until it's a blur, in a whole layer of tape around the outside. By the time they've finished, none of the cardboard of the box is even visible. There's no way that's getting broken into before it gets to its destination. Just spare a thought for the person who has to unwrap it at the other end though. They're gonna need a pretty decent pair of scissors. Number 2. World's Fastest Painter when D. Westry appeared on Anderson's Viewers Got Talent in 2012, he claimed to be a speed painter who could produce a masterpiece in under a minute and a half. The crowd didn't look convinced, and they had every reason not to be. As he got down to the final few seconds, the canvas just looked like random white paint splotches with a black background and a few random splotches of orange. There was no way he could pull it off. He then finished just a few seconds before the timer ran out, but the painting didn't even look remotely finished. It wasn't until he flipped it upside down that it revealed a man's face, and the crowd went wild. As it turns out, there are speedy painters all around the world. Vilas Nayak is one of the fastest painters in Asia and manages to produce beautiful masterpieces in just minutes. Given the size of the artwork, it almost seems impossible. But as he produces a massive picture of the Joker, it's clear to see he's got the technique nailed. He starts with a simple white outline before adding color and shading in all the right places. Number 1. Fastest Mochi Maker in Japan Mochi is a delicious Japanese rice cake made with short grain japonica glutinous rice. The rice is pounded into a paste and then turned into whatever shape is desired. It's a popular sweet treat at celebrations across Japan. But as you can imagine, pounding rice to form stretchy, delicious rice cakes would take a lot of work, hours and hours of it. This man, who is one of the fastest mochi makers in the world, makes it look like child's play. Visitors come from far and wide to watch Mitsuo Nakatani in his mochi shop. 
He has two people pounding the rice at one time, and it looks quite dangerous to watch. While one man is using his hands, another is using a giant hammer. We can't imagine that it will be fun for your fingers if you missed. Mitsuo said there is no formal training for making mochi, but it does require a lot of experience over many years. He manages to produce around three poundings to his mochi per second and said the key is about timing and trust. You'd have to have a lot of trust to put your hands where someone has a big hammer like that. Did anyone else just sit there and think about how long it took for these impressive workers to become that good at their jobs? Anything involving knives surely would have resulted in a few cuts and near misses. Have you seen anything like this in person? Maybe you're the incredibly efficient worker. Also, check out our other cool stuff showing up on screen right now. See you next time!